Wonderful. Anti-aircraft killers help Ukraine destroy Russian radar. Isolate 2,000 Russian infantry. The Ukrainian military has announced that it had destroyed Russia's advanced Nebo-M radar system using US-backed AGM-88 missiles. It is assumed that the AGM-88 can influence the military situation in Ukraine in the near future. In the second phase of the conflict, Russia deployed a dense air defense network in the Donbass and southern regions to improve Ukraine's ability to intercept missiles and unmanned aerial systems. In particular, the Ukrainian military used US-backed AGM-88 anti-radiation missiles to destroy a sophisticated Nebo-M radar station owned by the Russian military. Nebo-M is a radar that incorporates modern technology and is said to be able to detect stealth aircraft such as the American F-22 Raptor and F-35 Lightning II. The radar is capable of identifying and tracking enemy aircraft and ballistic missiles from a distance of 1,000 kilometers. The detection range of airborne and hypersonic targets is 600 kilometers, twice that of previous generations. On the evening of August 21, the Ukrainian Army Southern Combat Command issued a statement announcing multiple attacks on Russian military targets. As a result of the aforementioned attack, 20 soldiers were withdrawn from the combat ring, two Giant Sintes and MSTAS self-propelled artillery systems, two S-300 anti-aircraft missile systems, and two 120mm mortars, and three Russian Army armored vehicles. Russian engineers designed the Nebo-M radar to integrate and direct fire for the Russian military's Panzer S-300 and S-400 air defense systems. These radars have excellent combat power and maneuverability and have been supplied to the Crimean Air Defense Forces since 2018. Earlier, people familiar with the matter confirmed that the United States sent multiple AGM-88 missiles to Ukraine. The AGM-88 is a high-speed anti-radiation missile that has been in service with the US Air Force and Navy since 1985. The AGM-88 can target high-frequency radar and is considered the primary weapon. US performance against enemy air defenses. With missiles such as the AGM-88 capable of suppressing enemy air defenses, Ukraine can target Russian steel shields on the battlefield. According to the Kiev Post, US anti-radiation missiles are said to be involved in destroying at least five Russian anti-aircraft artillery systems, as well as four S-300 long-range surface-to-air missile systems and one missile system. Panzer S-1 missile system 